Crime investigation TV shows are turning into a tired genre, according to some critics. With their heyday in the mid-2000s, many shows are now being canceled due to low ratings. But Discovery's Manhunt is being held up as a shining example that could bring true crime TV back to its glory days. A terrorist called Unabomber is planning to blow up an airliner sometime during the next six days. Targeting airlines, scientists, computers, forestry people. Manhunt is Discovery Channel's eight part mini series detailing the investigation of mathematician, anarchist Ted Kaczynski, who was responsible for several domestic bombings in the US. The scripted drama brings fresh air to the network that is known for its reality based programming. You figure out the philosophy, you can figure out the man, you can crack the code. When I talked to my dad about it, my dad knew about him in Australia, so it showed how global you know, his, his wake was as a terrorist. Um, but I knew the, the, I knew the iconic picture and I knew that his brother might have turned him in. And then when you, you dig deeper and realize that 99% of our story is, the, is different to that and that in itself isn't true, um, that's interesting. I've, I've done movies like Everest and Hacksaw Ridge where you looked at an event from a different point of view. That's what this is. You're looking at something that you think you know in history and you're coming at it from a different angle. An operation of this size and scale is unprecedented. We believe it to be a singular opportunity to lure the Unabomber into the light. Manhunt also sheds light on why the Unabomber case has been dubbed the most expensive investigation in FBI history. All I have to do is write your name on a box and I can reach out and touch anyone, anywhere. Mostly when we think of the FBI, we think in very big general terms, and, and I think that um, the writer uh, of this, Andrew, really broke it down so that you saw the people in it and how they were dealing in that organization, and, um, and you get a sense of how slow moving something as big a bureaucracy as the FBI is and you get an idea of why they haven't caught him I mean because he was so smart and they were so bogged down in their own sort of conditioned way of approaching crime. The box comes with your name on it you can't even imagine doing anything other than obey. The show has been praised for its feature film quality something that is lacking in similar programs Critics say this might give Discovery that chance to beat drama networks at their own game for the first time. He's been outsmarting us the whole time.